What's up everyone, welcome back to another vlog. Back here with Farhan, haven't you? You weren't on the last vlog when we went and vlogged the Yeah, the I've been check. busy because uh, I got married, yes. so <laughs> that was uh, the deal and I've been disappeared but uh, the vlogs have been a bit low but we're gonna yeah, get sorry back and you know. Uh, but nevertheless, the car scene is back on. Today we are at an exclusive place. It's uh, hosted by Nissan and uh, this, this, is, this is one of one car. Uh, everyone knows the GTR, you know. Yeah. It's the iconic, legendary GTR. The and uh, they have managed to bring the GTR 50 Italian design from Goodwood. Ital, Ital design. Ital design. Yeah. I just kept. Yeah, I just love to say Italian. I don't know for some reason. <laughs> but they, uh, it was it was driven and seen for the first time at Goodwood. Yeah. So now you have the opportunity to see it in Dubai, in Dubai Crazy. Autodrome. One of one. Yeah, one of one. We're here to just check that car out in person. Apparently in pictures, it's just mind blowing. Yeah. The Let's back of the car is just alien. And so it's, it what, nice and it's, it's it. a little, it's worth over a little, like 1.05 million. 1.05. Like right? Let's see if it's worth. Yeah, that let's much. go back. For the sun. Let's go guys, let's see, let's see it out. See you guys there. Let's go, let's go. Man, I'm kind of excited, you know, because uh, GTR is every, you know, every teenage, every 90s kid's yeah, dream. Yeah, yeah. You, you know, have you a GTR. Buy one for years. Yeah, I was gonna buy, but you know, it's a bit too outdated when it uh, came to for me to buy. It. And look at this, guys. I can't, I can't wait. I can't wait to enter and see this Ital Design GTR 50. I know it's, it's a, a bit overpriced. Yeah. Of course, man. It's a wee six. I will be feeling super guys. That's the deal with this. Man. Just driving it yeah. and getting the feel of the car. It's the first time that uh, pu uh, public is getting uh, to test drive that car. Yeah, I'm just gonna say one of one car, and there are a lot of people to drive it. That's yeah, crazy. and that only happens in Dubai. So this GTR is just made everyone like stand their grounds. It's it's just amazing. What do you think, Pongi? It, it looks it looks it looks 10 out of 10. It sounds it, it sounds very nice. Yeah, in person it yeah. looks way better, and uh, you know. The only thing which is to show in the future is like the performance, how fast does it go and stuff. But as usual, GTR will impress. You know, well, they have they have when dominated. They, launched, they were they were called what the supercar killer. Yeah, and it's in, actually scary seeing yeah. the way it looks in person. In 2007, it was known as the supercar killer, and for 10 years, bro, it dominated yeah. the supercar era. So much to the point where this guy, this idiot, <laughs> yeah, thought instead of buying the McLaren, he'd get two GTRs, one for him, one for his brother. <laughs> Honestly, I'm happy he didn't get one because yeah. it was a supercar killer, but not yeah. anymore. So GTR is basically known to like defy the laws of physics. It is heavier, it has less power, but the engineering and the physics that's been used on this car is just crazy. I mean, look at the aerodynamics. The w everything on this car has a purpose and its purpose is to serve performance. Performance on the track, raw performance. So uh, it's crazy. It's going to be a very complete car. It will be nice to see that on the roads. And bro, why are you wearing a helmet already? They just gave us a free helmet, bro. Sponsored now GTR for life, you know, GTR fanboys. Back GTR. <laughs> so, apparently, they're giving everyone whoever test drives the car a uh, free helmet. Oh, but seriously? GTR, yeah, and it's like, got a it's, GTR nice, so it's actually nice. Cool. It's yeah. like, you know, memorable stuff. Maybe we won't get to buy one, but. <laughs> At least you can have the helmet. Mo, no, what do you insane, think, man? Insane, insane. Crazy, eh? I was so scared the whole time. <laughs> I was just like praying nothing happens. I was like, please don't crash. One of one. Yeah, one of one. But they were telling me like, if anything happens, there's no other GTR. I was like, oh, thank you. <laughs> Damn, that, just there, a goes, there goes everything. Just, just a reminder. Oh. <laughs> Love that sound. <laughs> Never gets old. I know, right? That's so guys, time to put in... I hate this. <laughs> so guys, it's time to put an end to the vlog with Mr. Hey! Mo Vlogs. Expect new videos to come Yo, out soon. We're going to be doing a collab. Why do I look collab. so orange? I have no idea. It's the sun, bro. Even bro, that's all crazy. Of us. I look really good, though. I can't lie. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Lana. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, drive safe.
Drive safe. Peace. Yeah, that's the best thing to say. Drive safe. While you heard that. <laughs> Anyways, guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. We'll catch you guys next vlog. Take care. Peace. Oh, shit. Bye. <laughs> Alright, so Pungi couldn't grab me because he was busy vlogging other YouTubers, but nevertheless, I just got out of the GTR. It is it is nice, but it's because it's a prototype, it needs uh, work on its suspension as of the prototype yet. But uh, the response, the sound, the drama is there. I won't talk so much of the performance because it's, it's just a down. yeah, it's kind of tuned down and it's not the final version of the car, so it's not really the hardcore version of the car. And Nismo is going to be working on the car. Nismo hasn't worked on this one because this is just a prototype, but they're yeah. waiting for the Nismo to do their magic on the car and. Uh, uh, I, I really want it to be a really successful car, in, uh, in, which means it's like, in terms of performance, keep up with the with the cars of this generation. Because what I'm hoping for, yeah. sorry to cut you off, is that I hope they bring back that title, the supercar. Yeah, supercar killer. Hey, it's not necessary to kill a supercar, but at least at it should least be like competitive with up that. Up there on yeah. that level. Because, because you are paying a lot. You're paying a million dollars for this. Yeah, and that's, that's not a, a small price. Yeah, that's not a small price. Bad. So that's again debatable and it's a bit controversial. Would you be spending one million dollars? Or is it going to be limited? On dancing. I'm sure it will if be limited. If it's limited, then it makes sense because yeah. it could be an appreciating yeah. asset. Yeah, that's that as well. But nevertheless, it was very nice. I didn't expect to drive the car or to see it when it, when I first saw it. So it's we're really lucky to actually see it, yeah. meet some other people, meet a lot of vloggers and stuff. and. Drive the car itself. GTR 720 horsepower, McLaren 720 720 horsepower. Let's go, man. Ending the day with my one and only McLaren. This is my McLaren Senna. This is my 675 LT. I've driven 20,000 on this and I still get straight scared. Sheer One power, man. Straight, nothing comes close. Straight line is too much. No supercar comes close to this. Hey, like, we, I, I've driven like Amrits 812, you've driven 812, you've yeah. driven GT3 RS. But this thing, it this pulls. This thing holds, bro. It oh holds. my god, this thing, when it pulls, you just go like, okay, this is serious, you know? It, it, pulls, it yeah. pulls a serious face. It's crazy.